Alright, what is good YouTube boss man from Shyrak News. So I'm bringing you guys a highly requested video I've been asking for, man. L.A. Capone, one of the most uh, well-known, infamous, talked about uh, rappers coming out of Chicago, man. And uh, it sucks because he didn't really get to, uh, he didn't get to live in the benefits of uh, his glory, man. Um, like most of these uh, rappers, they uh, they blow up after they die. Like Chicago knew about him, but the world didn't really know about him, man. But I, I, I know I didn't listen to him in my top five, my last video. That was just my personal top five, but LA LA is definitely in the top three of uh like lyric like just talent wise, potential personas, every everything. He's definitely uh in the list of the top uh, three artists, man. But we'll talk a little bit about his music. He uh his three biggest tracks were probably Shooters, uh, sep or, uh Play for Keeps, and uh, but the whole Separate Myself mixtape, man, it's a classic. Uh, my favorite tracks are fucking the first Separate Myself. Uh, I got it. And then that Steve Drive joint, man, that shit is tough. And it sucks because he didn't get to shoot a video for any of those, man. And if he did, I'm telling you, all of those would have 10, 20 million on YouTube. Um, it's just, he didn't get to live, man. He didn't get to bask in his glory. But yeah, man, the music side, uh, LA definitely had it. And that's why a lot of dudes was jealous. They knew he was about to blow up. Um, so for the shooting part, man, um, this is all known. The three people uh, who did it were tried or convicted and uh, sentenced already. But uh, yeah, this this was 051 Young Money. This dude Low Mick Rockhead and uh, so uh, what's this other? I think his name Michael Miko Buchanan. But uh, like you like you guys probably know, uh, he was he was at a studio. He was waiting for a taxi cab in an alley. Uh, and I'm gonna show you guys coming up the exact alley. And uh, yeah, man, they caught him down there. But uh, L.A. definitely uh, had a street reputation. I I I don't know of any bodies that I can definitely say he had, man. I know a lot of people. Uh, they they uh, say he killed a uh, fathead, but I do not believe he was the shooter on that. Um, I, I do think he was on that hit, but uh, no man, I don't think he was the actual shooter. Um, I think this dude M Thang from Six Hundred, who's locked up, was the actual one who uh, got credit with that. But yeah, man, I'm gonna pull up this map and I'm gonna show you guys the exact location. All right, man. So he got killed September 26, uh, 2013, in the uh, 7,000 block of Stony Island. So that's so that's this uh, Jackson Park South Shore area, very close still to Woodlawn Washington Park. And um, yeah, man, listen, I should I should not say exact location, because I actually do not know like the exact spot like where his body was. Um, and you know, you guys know if you watch most of my videos, man, I, I do a pretty damn good job of showing you the exact location. So I'm not going to vouch on the exact location, but uh, I'm going to show you guys. So this is a uh, 70th and Stony Island, or 70th and Stony Island right here. So it was either uh, I, I, I'm 100% sure it was this alley right here, man. But I do have a good source who tries to swear it was this one, but I'm 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 not, man. I'm telling you, it was this alley right here. Um, so we're going to go down this, and the cool thing is we can actually go right down this alley. Um, so I kind of want someone in my comments, I mean, you guys tell me if you know, uh, the exact location, just comment it out, like, just what, t uh, the time of the video, like, where it was when I passed through, so, this is gonna be the, uh, 70th and Stony Island right here, man, yeah, cause on this side, man, there's no, there's no buildings, it's like gas station, a school, and they said it was at a recording studio, like, there's a bunch of little small, uh, buildings on this side, man, like, I'm positive it was this alley, but like I said, a, a good source who, he knows shit, man, he swears it was that other alley, but, all right, so this is the cut right here, man. We're gonna and like I said, we can actually go down it. So this is the seventieth. Where this is seventieth and Stony Island right there. Right? So this is first gangway, man. Um, but like I said, I don't know the exact location, but it was definitely somewhere in this alley. Uh, he was waiting for a taxi cab. But if any of you guys know watching, man, comment and let me know um, the exact spot. But yeah, man, this is the alley right here. Yeah, I don't know. I, there hasn't been like a, there's no pictures from the scene. So sometimes I'll go look up pictures and uh, get you guys the exact location. But uh, yeah, man, that's the alleyway right there, man, where LA was killed. We'll, we'll go over on this side just because like, like I'll show you guys, look, especially if you, even if you go down Stony Island, like. There's all these small businesses. I was I was looking for a recording studio. I don't know if it was like a private recording studio or uh, it was an actual studio. There's there's no recording studios on this side, but it, it could just not be there anymore. Um, I know this is a, this is Street Views, June 2017. So I know businesses change a lot. There's this photography place right here, but uh, 
Yeah, there's no recording studio anymore. So if you guys got uh, more details, man, comment. I like y'all to help me out sometimes too, man. Someone's got to know the exact spot where his uh, where he actually got shot. But yeah, so this is back on the corner of 70th and Stony Island, and then this whole side, man, is just like a gas station and a school. But uh, I think you can actually go down this gangway too, right here. So yeah, this, this is where one of my one of my buddies, a pretty good source, he he swears it was this alley, man, but. Like I said, I, I, I could be wrong. Um, I wasn't there, man, obviously. But we'll go down this alleyway just in case. I just don't see, man, how it could have been this one. But, yeah, man, he, he swears this. I'm telling y'all it was that other one. But comment below, man. Let me know if anyone knows anything. And, uh, yeah, man, just stay tuned. I got a lot more videos coming up for y'all. So it's your boy, Boss Money, man. Stay safe out there and shy